Well, Colorado is reviewing the way it deals with potentially ineligible voters. This comes after questions are raised about whether officials violated federal law by removing voters from the registry illegally. Secretary of State Mike Kaufman says the accusations in the New York Times are, quote, out to lunch. Fox 31's Hendrix Brandy is live at the Capitol with why Kaufman says the story is not true. Hendrick. Ron, the uh, front page article is headlined, States Purges of Voter Rolls Appear Illegal. Colorado is one of six swing states named in the story. But this afternoon, Secretary of State Kaufman said emphatically, Colorado does not belong on the list. Here to go over, uh, there was a New York Times story that was pretty out to lunch. It was, uh, the numbers uh, were way off. With just 26 days left until the election, Secretary of State Mike Kaufman tried to reassure voters today that this New York Times article was way off base. According to the Times, the vast majority of 37,000 voters removed from state voting rolls in July and August should not have been. That the so-called purges happened too close to the election. Kaufman says just 14,000 registrations were canceled, all for legitimate reasons. I think the election is moving along very well, and we're going to have minor glitches, and the glitches that have occurred are very minor. Uh, you know, I uh, um, think we're going to, I think election day is going to go very smooth. Of the 14,000 names that were removed, Kaufman says 2,400 were duplicate records that were canceled within that 90-day window before the election. He's asking for a legal ruling on that. And even if the voter does show up and they have been canceled by either a data entry error or some uh, oversight in the county, they can show up and, and still will be allowed to cast a provisional ballot. That is correct. Some election watchers are concerned about the Times story and Kaufman's response. He needs to ensure that every eligible voter can vote who wants to vote and that those votes will ultimately be counted. And we need to see strong leadership from him right now. Now, Kaufman is also under fire from Governor Ritter. 4,000 Colorado voters were given inaccurate information about their registration applications. The governor wants the Secretary of State to be more aggressive in dealing with that. Ron? Hendrick Sabrandi, live tonight from the Capitol.